Hi everybody, this is City Readings and hi Aquarius. Let's see what messages will show up for you guys. What do we have for Aquarius? In case this reading resonates, there will be a link in the description box to the extended to find out how is your person thinking, feeling about you, their next moves, outcome of ice, love notes, guidance from spirit and your future love. So do check it out. It will be linked underneath the video for you guys. Okay. Let's see. What do we have for Aquarius, please? What do we have for Aquarius? We have delight and trust. Okay. Some of you might be seeing synchronicities around you at this time. Aquarius, like, you know, um, angel numbers, repeated numbers, okay? Because with the delight and the trust energy, it's almost like it's, it's, I'm getting the temperance vibes from this, okay? Let's see though. We have the fool here. So there is a new beginning coming up for you guys. I am going to read for you what these cards are saying towards the end of your reading, okay? There is a new beginning here. I feel like a lot of you are trying to let go of your past patterns. Um, let's see. It does look like Aquarius, you lost your passion in a situation, okay? Um, but the good thing is that you're opening up to the new possibilities. I like it. You're trying to be confident in your vibe. Some of you are planning ahead for the future. Your main focus is on yourself. And I feel like when it comes to a relationship, you're not really letting it um, impact you the way that it impacted you before. Okay, bottom of the deck is the Knight of Pentacles upright with the Queen of Swords upright. I feel like a lot of you are detaching from a situation that you lost hope and faith in, okay? There has been a situation that was immensely like out of balance and a lot of you are trying to find yourself again from what I can see. All right, let me actually clarify things for you now. All right. What about the Fool? Tell me about the Fool card here, please. with the seven of pentacles i feel like for a lot of you your focus is on moving ahead your focus is on um letting go of something okay it is about what can i do to make it easy for myself because i feel like something in the past stressed you out a lot and you overgave in a situation Aquarius with the nine of swords reverse it's like you're trying to let go of what has been stressing you out it's like you're finally seeing your way out of a situation but the thing is that it's it's almost like with the nine of pentacles energy you're you're trying to be self-sufficient which is okay but that is showing up in your challenge being the nine of pentacles so let's see why is that your focus is on the new and the time to come will bring more um, opportunities for you to grow. Four of Swords energy. Something is still bothering you or it's giving you that restless feeling. 
even though you may be trying to get over it i feel like it is still very much present in your energy aquarius okay let's see tell me about the ace of wands reverse I'm also getting a vibe here of you secluding yourself. Yeah, there's a situation from the past that you lost your passion for. And it seems like there's a conflict here with the Five of Wands energy. Okay, you're letting go of this. Aquarius, I feel like there is something that you... I don't know, like I'm getting an energy of self-doubt. So there's something that you want to do, but you're doubting yourself. I don't know what exactly this is. Let's see. With the High Priestess energy, your intuition is screaming at you to go in a certain direction. But with the Strength Reverse and the Wheel of Fortune, it's like... I don't know if this is worth it or not kind of an energy. Mm. You know what to do, okay? I do like your energy with the Queen of Wands. It's like you're continuously trying to pick yourself back up, you know, being confident again. For a lot of you, you are pretty much in that mindset where it's like, you know, you're confident, you're focused on yourself, but there is a hint of, you know, self-doubt here with, am I on the right path? Is this the right thing that I'm doing or not? There's a little bit of worry that I see here, okay? Lack of trust. The more you open up to the possibilities around you, the more you will see. King of Cups energy. Your advice here is to let go of a toxic pattern, Aquarius. Why the chariot and the queen of wands, please? Tell me about the chariot and the queen of wands. Emperor and the four of wands. This is about stability. This is about taking back control. Okay. This could even be about a relationship that you want to be in. But it's like you are with the chariot energy. You're very determined to move towards something. Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. For some of you, there is a focus on a relationship here. And there could be very well, you know, there could be a new beginning for you guys. With the Ace of Pentacles energy. Ten of Pentacles. I feel like there's a big focus on your money as well. Like there's something you're trying to achieve or you're trying to work towards. I feel like that self-doubt is coming in from what your intuition is trying to tell you. You're trying to suppress it. Let's see. What is the King of Pentacles reverse? The Star and the Three of Wands. Your focus is on yourself and there's something um, that you're planning ahead, okay? with the star and the three of wands energy this is nice because it, it just looks like aquarius you are choosing yourself okay you're choosing yourself you're healing there's a very calm confident energy however 
at this time it is very important for you Aquarius to to go towards what you feel the most passionate about okay so because I feel like there's your soul's calling to do something uh, but maybe you're not trusting it enough or you're suppressing it yeah it's like two of swords avoidance kind of an energy what is the ace of cups reverse to the lovers reverse whoever you're dealing with i feel like this person has love for you but they feel like there has been a missed opportunity it also looks like this person queen of cups in the world Now, I don't know, Aquarius, if it is you or your person, but somebody here feels like the other person has options. And that is the reason why they're backing off is because they feel like the other person has options. Whoever you're dealing with, they're getting a cold wipe from you. And this person feels like it's going to be a bad idea to try to make things happen with you because you might ignore them or neglect them. Because Ace of Cups reverse is still Ace of Cups. I also feel like this could be a person who's trying to focus on other things or they may have tried to shift their focus onto other things just to distract themselves from the situation. Because with you, the vibe that they're getting is that you don't want them okay and with the world energy it's almost like they're telling themselves that this is maybe done what is the seven of cups yes of pentacles mm. it keeps showing me that this person does want you but they don't know if it's a good idea or not <laughs> If this choice is gonna work out or not you on the other hand your focus is on dropping this or you're not carrying the burden anymore yeah you feel like this is too toxic for you to try to manifest okay you feel like dealing with a certain situation it's like you get entangled so you're letting it go you're letting go of a situation that is making you feel restless I also feel like Aquarius, you're opening yourself up to new possibilities in your life. And I'm also getting that some of you might have cut off a friend recently. Okay. Some of you might have let go, let gone of a friend. Yeah, I see you realizing your self-worth. A lot of you have made that conscious decision that I'm not going to indulge in situations, friendships, people that no longer serve me or, you know, drain me energetically. And that is good. Tell me about their advice. Aquarius, check out the link in the description box. It will take you to the extended to find out how is your person thinking, feeling about you, their next moves, outcome advice, love notes, guidance from spirit, and your future love. So do check it out. It will be linked underneath the video for you guys, okay? Let's see. What do we have for Aquarius? What is the devil reverse? Page of wands. The lovers. I feel like the mistake or the lesson, I should say, that you need to learn from your past relationships is that there was something that was very one-sided, okay? And the energies keep telling you to focus on, to focus on relationships, people, situations, that serve you not drain you okay mm -hmm. 
there is a new possibility even page of wands this is like telling you to open up to something new but with the devil reverse you need to let go of a toxic pattern hermit thinking things through i feel like somebody has an eye on you or there's a new beginning right there in front of you king of coins so we have the king and the queen of coins now queen of swords your advice is to open up because page of wands is like an energy that is very enthusiastic he wants to explore okay but the devil reverse tells you to let go of something toxic all right let's see i really feel like you're manifesting a person like a new person maybe let's see what delight and trust are saying for you to close off your reading and i will link your extended underneath the video to find out how is your person thinking feeling about you their next moves outcome of ice love notes guidance from spirit and your future love so do check it out it will be linked below the light is expanding in your life clap your hands with glee spend time with others go to a community gathering host a party the joy you experience will give birth to immense creativity and your life will blossom share your happiness and elation with others and it will grow by leaps and bounds this isn't the time to be serious or buckle down and get to work this is the time to be spontaneous. Do not make hard and fast commitments. Don't sign any legal documents or make any pledges right now. Don't make any promises or you might not be able to keep them. Uh, sorry, give yourself the permission to have fun and lots of fun, especially in community with others. Let's read for you trust. This is a powerful and important card to receive even when things seem parched or not fruitful a deeper energy speaks of the power of your inner knowing meditate trust those nudges from the universe your celestial advisors are closed now you are now open to receive some of the most important messages of your life through your intuition your intuition is spot on so trust it and even if there are some areas of your life that seem lackluster know that other areas are being fertilized for a great future have faith and know that there is a higher purpose so that's about it aquarius those were the messages that came up for you i hope that you were open to receive these messages and i hope that you got something out of the reading i will link your extended underneath the video to find out how is your person thinking feeling about you their next moves outcome of ice love notes guidance from spirit and your future love so do check it out it will be linked underneath the video for you guys take care and bye bye, bye.